Oh, 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 oh. I just want to throw that ignite down, boys. For the vision. For the vision. Where's our Shin at? I forgot to use my pot. I'm exhausted. We didn't even kill that guy. I accidentally hit the wrong guy. Well, that's a little bit rough. It would have been really nice if we had Shin in front and I missed the kill on Thresh. But I think what I can do here is I try to gank bottom because Jinx is worth a really big shutdown and Thresh has no flash and Jinx has no flash, right? So knowing this, it'd be really, really good to gank that lane because if I don't gank that lane, my bot lane is going to significantly get wrecked because Jinx is going to come back with at least a noon quiver, right? So we really, 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 really got to help that lane out. Like they're just going to need it, right? <laughs> they're just going to need it. And I should chuck my pot earlier. That was my bad. But still, Shin should have been there. Um, no, why? Just wait for me, bro. Why? Bro, I didn't even get time to clear the Krugs before he already died. <sighs> I want to go bot. I do. But the problem is, is like now Kai'Sa is like, can you volley? Nice. Keep keep applying the slow. Keep applying the slow. Bro, I hit a minion. Oh, why is he so fast? Do I have a volley coming in hot? Okay. Well, that was a bit rough, but the longer we keep Jinx out of that lane, the better. Honestly, I have a really good idea here, guys. What I want to do is we want to keep ganking bot. Because I think ganking bot is just uh, probably the preferred way here. Because this Jinx is so far ahead. She's so far ahead that if I do not continue to gank bot, she's just going to continue to get a gigantic snowball lead. So we're just going to keep focusing bot. And this is my attempt. This is my attempt at bringing the game back. Right? Because you know that she has such a big lead. She has boots. Tier 2 boots now. Oh, she has such a big lead that she's going to continue to try and snowball it. Just just do it, bro. Oh. Okay. Nice. That's how we do it. So we were putting a lot of resources into that, trying to get it going. And it really paid off because we got a lot of gold. Like, we're, we're way ahead of the curve in terms of gold. So we're doing okay. And now Kaisa is doing significantly better as well. So now we have the Noon Quiver boots. And now we have a refillable potion, a Dorans. And, uh, right, we just, we win bot lane now. Now bot lane is winnable. And it's because I decided to, it was better for me to put my time into that. And that's actually 100% okay. Because you gotta remember, I also, I'm the one that got shut down on Jinx, right? Kaisa didn't even get that, so I got so much gold that. What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, what is this disaster, man? Bro, like... Wait, they don't even see the Shin Shield. They literally did not see the Shin Shield. Dude, I'm telling you, that skin is so pay to win. You literally cannot even see it. Like, they were just still fighting for it, even though there was a Shin Shield coming in. It's so pay to win. It is actually such a pay to win skin. Okay. Yeah, I actually think that skin is nuts. I've, I've, over the years, I've learned to back off. But, like, sometimes you can't even tell if that's a shield from Shin or a shield from a Karma or something like that, right? Like, because, you know, Shin has that very typical, like, pink shield that he usually has on his overlay, right? Um, so. Let's go ahead, uh... Grab this dragon here, and hopefully, well, let's sweep it first. Well, when I say first, I mean after. Let's sweep it after the fact. But the idea is, well, let, let's sweep it before we kill it. Because I saw Wukong back, and he's probably needing uh, topside. I don't need any of that. Because I can heal off of the, uh, the camps. Oh, unless they're, like, calling me immediately, dude. Dude, Kaisa's wrecking. Look at that. Look at that. That's because of me, guys. 
Tell me, tell me that you think Kaisa would have done well without me uh, spam ganking on that bot lane. Oh, it feels so good when you do something so right and it pays off, right? Absolutely, because you know it could have uh, could have went completely the other way, and then Kaisa just ended. <laughs> could have. Fortunately, it didn't though. Fortunately, it didn't. That one went so right because if we had just left Kaisa to like her own devices against that Jinx, you guys know exactly what would have happened there, right? You guys know exactly what would have happened there. Um, let's go ahead and grab these wolves and begin clearing towards the Gromp. Not too bad. Okay. So we know Wukong probably did crab here. So I'm just going to ping it. And then after this, we have enough for an eight minute blade and rune king, which is insane. Very nice. Very insane. Oh, I just missed click. Very nice. Very insane. Let's go over here. Seven plus 60. I could actually gank him. I'm just going to help clear this for Shen. And I'm going to back off. And then what we could do here, guys, is we can go around the Rift Herald. So, oh, yeah, there's no crab here. But typically, uh, you can just uh, path around the crab here. And you can do Rift Herald without them seeing you. So we're going to do this. Man, Kai's is popping. It feels good, man. It feels so good, man. I don't know why. I'm more happy for her success than I am for my own success. I mean, I'm 2-4. Like, the thing is, guys, I'm 2-4, but I have an insane amount of gold. I already have more than enough for Blade and Ring King, right? Not bad. Who am I missing a stack on? I think it's Wayne. Uh, let's get the Blade and Ring King, and let's grab the Berserker Greaves. Just making sure those are the boots I want. I'm pretty happy with those results. And we might consider... Oh. Dude, imagine, imagine being this Jinx and starting the game 3-0-1 and starting with the Noon Quiver in lane, right? Imagine. And still losing. All right, let's go for this. I mean, I'm down, but I need my bot lane. Okay, I'm going for it. Does she have ulti again? Dude, that'd be so troll. I saved the tower. Shoot an arrow, boys. Oh, that was so close. Wait, what was that lantern? What was that lantern? All right, let's push hard. And we got Shelly. I don't want to push it like immediately. Here, let's just push it in like this. Oh, wait for it. Jesus. She's an eager beaver, guys. All right, so we want to get this far down as possible before Shelly smacks it because it does true damage and the tower gets more armor to lower it is, right? Look at that. Ooh. Okay, not too bad. And then we can push another one. And, I, wow, I'm getting out-leveled by Kai'Sa now. Man, she managed to get in that bush just in time. Dude, I can't even alpha. I couldn't get in range of alpha, boys. What was that arrow? What was that arrow? Oh, oh god. Oh god. Okay, not too bad. Not too bad. Bro, I don't know. It's just like the more successful this Kaisa gets, the more happy I am with myself because I put all that effort into getting her ahead early. Right? Like, just, dude, just like imagine if I had just left her alone. I can't get over that. I can't go over how much of a different game this is because of my decision making there. It's happy times, boys. It's happy times. All right, let's go to sweep this. And let's go get our camps. And we're doing really well in terms of gold. I'm very happy with where my gold's at. I really need that Swain kill. Uh, have not decided. I think we'll probably get like a Death Dance and a Shield Bow. Maybe get the Shield Bow first into the Death Dance. Mm, not even too sure about that. The thing is we need Death Dance to survive Wukong Burst. Because if we don't have Death Dance, right, we don't do that much damage. I'm just zoning uh, Wukong a little bit. And now I go get Dragon. Man, Shin is such a busted champ. I don't know, dude. I don't know why more people don't play Shin. Like, that champion just makes such, such a big deal in teamfights. 
Like, he can turn a game so easily compared to so many other champions. Well, that dragon just leveled up on me. I feel like dragons shouldn't be able to level up in combat. Okay, got the ward out of the way. We're going to go grab ourselves a red. Actually, Kaisa could probably make good juice out of this red buff, to be honest. But I'm probably going to take it anyway. What do you build? Oh, yeah, Collector. That's Collector. Too bad she's not an AP Kaisa, huh? Man, just imagine. Imagine how mad the Jinx's team is, right? You start out 3-0-1. You end up 5-7-4. Dude, what do you guys think? Was this a jungle diff? Was it a jungle diff? It feels kind of jungle diffy. Like, whoo! So we grab Blade of the Rune King. And, oh wait, we already got a blade. I'm, I'm dumb. I, I zoned out, guys. I zoned out. I'm kind of tempted. I really want two different options here. I want either a shield bow. I want Death Dance. I want Gunzus. And yes, I know that was more than two options. Um, there's just so many good options there that I get. I want to get that Death Dance. It wasn't bot diff. It's important to remember it's not bot diff, guys. Because if it was bot diff, then they would have done it without me. They would have done it without me. Well, maybe they could have. They maybe could have done that without me. You never know. Like if I was not there. So let's go ahead and grab this Gromp. Oh, baby. I want to go grab that uh, Crab in the River. Crab in the River would be really, really good. Let's grab this. Oh, my juicy wolves. I love you. Okay, so the wolves are acquired. I could actually make a move on this bot lane here. Especially if Ash had arrow, but Ash does not have arrow. Let's go get Crab instead. And I could sweep this to see if it's warded. I don't actually care if it's warded, though. Not at the current moment. Now I'm going to sweep. Oh, did he see me come out of that bush? Hey, guys. Yeah, I'm just going to blast over into here. Nothing here. Who's their top laner? Jax. Jax is a bit hard for a yee dodge. Dive. Yee dive. Because the problem with uh, diving that is that Jax can stun f or he can use his counter strike long enough that, you know, the tower kills you. Uh, red should be gone. Ash has an arrow. She's firing it. <laughs> that arrow, though. That arrow. I, I saw the arrow coming, okay? I saw it coming. I was paying attention to it on the minimap. Did they increase the arrow travel speed on Ash? I think they did, right? I recall that. Anyway, let's uh, deny them the Rift Herald here. Very nice Rift Herald. And, um, hmm. Okay, Kaisa. <laughs> okay, Kaisa, chill, bro. Chill. Kaisa, Kaisa never got any of that chill. Let's kill ourselves Rift Herald and prepare to push us here. It's only a 19 to 13 game right now, guys. It's not even like hugely in our favor in terms of kills. But I got full control over the dragon because I did give that priority to my bot lane. And we're getting pretty close to the shield bow. 1,750 on this thing. I'm coming. Okay. Dude, this Shin all is crazy. It's crazy good. It is so good. Now we can continue to try and snowball this game here. Let's continue pushing it here. Okay, that's one. We're going to wait for this one. Actually, I think I can start focusing the cannon here, which is great for us because it keeps Shelly alive. Hi, guys. Ow, what killed me? Well, let's go ahead and head towards the dragon. We have full dragon control, but this game could easily still go in the enemy's favor. They have a decently fed Jinx because of that early game. They have a Wukong with a massive team advantage with his knockup, and they also have Jax as well, and Jax can really snowball. So what I want to do... Ooh, another Ash arrow. Almost, though. Man, that would have been sick if she had killed that Wukong with it. Man, Ash is just such an OG champion. All right, let's go ahead and grab these Krugs here. And then we're going to pivot over into the dragon. we got to keep that dragon advantage going that we have going on here. So I'm just going to grab this. And the shield bow keeps me alive. So the idea behind the shield bow is I want to stay alive while Wukong is ulting. And when Jax is on me, like that last fight where I died in top lane, Wukong was ulting. And, um, you know, uh, <clears throat> yeah, I couldn't survive, right? I need to be able to survive long enough to do some autos to him. So that's what the shield bow is for here. And then probably a Death Dance or a Gunsu. It depends on if I want damage or not. Gotcha. Yeah, I gotcha. No, you got a minion. Oh, no. I hit the wrong one. 
Oy, what a throw, guys. Well, there's the throw. Um, let's go help with this Baron. Yeah, we need everybody here. Um, yeah, you know, he's pinging me. And, you know, I'm sad. I'm sad to hear it. I'm sad that he's not happy with my performance thus far. But uh, we'll see how this goes. We'll see how this goes. Okay, not too bad. They know we're here. Hopefully Wukong doesn't dash over the wall at me. Okay, and we managed to pick up the Baron. We have a lot of damage. This game's really close, guys. Like, we put him ahead. Honestly, the only reason we're still in it is because Kais is somewhat ahead. All right, bro. You need 33 gold. You couldn't just go sit in the fountain for that 30 gold, bro. You got to mess with me. Okay, Ash is dead. I can actually split push in the jacks. I'm better equipped than he is in terms of itemization. But we got to be careful with him pre-stacking. Like, you stack him really hard. Make him make him take his time. If he's not stacked, I just kill him, right? <laughs> that was really dumb of him. He got really greedy. I had shield bow, right, at the end of the day. Wait, enemy rampage? Who died now? Shin? Dude, does Shin keeps dying without ulting. Right? We need him to, like, all Kai'Sa. We need a fight where he, like, all Kai'Sa. Hmm. Good try on that arrow. Man, that arrow's really fast now. Definitely, definitely feeling it. Um, I'm going to keep pushing. Kaisa got a kill, but now Kaisa's dead, and she's our fed person, so I don't know how to feel about that, guys. Um, Yeah, dragon spawning soon, but I'm, like, completely on the opposite side of the map for this. Is there these Krugs up? Okay, I guess I'll go for it. Okay, and we gotta go bottom. I'm coming. I'm coming. Jinx is dead. Kai's is dead. I'm fed enough, but I don't have shield bone. I don't have a uh, Highlander. But I think that we can secure this dragon soul if we really, 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 really put our minds and our hearts into it. Though Wukong is probably gonna pop me. But we do have uh, Shin. We have Shin alt if all goes well here. Uh, they have Jax already, though. I don't know about that one, homie. What was that arrow? Before anybody's here to capitalize on it, he shoots his arrow. Man, we're just getting that poke down, though. We're getting tons of poke. Uh, I, I feel like I should just go in on it. Wukong's nowhere near it. Yeah, they've given it up. They've just got poked down too much by my team, huh? That was the arrow. He was poking them down. But we are securing all the objectives. We got a dragon without them securing one. They still have objective bounties. It feels like they can win this game, but they still have objective bounties, which is crazy. It's crazy how they still have objective bounties, but I'm at level 14. I'm higher level than their whole team. I'm 4 and 7, guys, but I'm still higher level than their whole team, right? So, um... Okay, unfortunately, I got Zanyad. So, the options are stopwatch for the team fights. We have death dance for the team fights, but stopwatch is, like, if we think the game's only going to last for one more team fight, right? I mean, stopwatch is just such a big item. I'm not sure how long this game's going to last for, so I'm going to go for the death dance as my item because I want that extra armor. Like, I want that extra armor throughout the game instead of just for uh, a stopwatch in one team fight. But the stopwatch could potentially swing the game in our favor in one team fight, right? I get a reset. And this Ash just likes to launch those arrows, boys. Um, we got two minutes on Baron. It could easily turn against us if they get this Elder Dragon. This game is not even close to over. Like, dude, they, they could actually win the game while having objective bounties up. I could I could see that. I could actually literally see that happening. That's how broken objective bounties are. Mm, tied in CS. Oriana has a lot of CS over Swain. That's probably where a lot of the bounties are coming from. Uh, some big gold diff in bot lane, too. And But... Where am I? Oh, I'm right here. Oh, I'm dead. That's where I'm at. Huh. Well, I think my team might be able to push this one in. I'm going to go ahead and prepare this just in case because you guys know you need to increase the pick and purchase rate of Guardian Angel on Zanya's Iris Glass in every game you play. And that indeed does look like it's it. So if you guys enjoyed this game, make sure to check out this game because these games are amazing and I'm sure you'll enjoy it.